So in case if you have been living under a rock for the past couple of days, most of you already know now there will not, sadly, not be a new update this week. The mini update that was supposed to come in uh, PSX. I just learned that it's called PSX, Pet Simulator X. Wow, big brain, big brain RAM, big brain, big brain. And the reason for no update this week is because Preston, Preston has been moving. Apparently he has moved to a new spot. He's been moving on up. Moving on up. Yee. And I'm not gonna complain. I'm not gonna complain because I've been there before myself. I just recently moved from another city to another city. From a smaller city to a bigger city. And it's quite frustrating to move. You think it's gonna be somewhat easy. And it's always worse than you think. It's always gonna take a little bit longer than you think. And it's gonna take a bit more hard work to move. So I can totally relate as I have moved recently. And so I'm not going to complain. No update. Fair enough. He moved. So hopefully next week. But that made me think. Does the next update, the mini update, will it be small? Or will it actually be a big update? Because now he has a bit of time, a bit of extra time to finish that mini update. And maybe we don't know. They might add some new things to the game. Okay, let's not waste any time here. Today's like goal. Let's see if we can hit it. Nope. But 5,581. Smash like, please. Okay. Take care you. Now, the next update was supposed to feature uh, top hats and steampunk. Steampunk theme. So it's almost similar to Ram. Almost similar to me. The steampunk theme. But apparently, the hats are not going to be added for some reason. I think it might be because they have a hard time, like... Uh, equipping the hats on the pets like in blender designing the hats and making them look good on the pets it's not gonna be easy because i already saw those leaks because i already saw those leaks at least 24 hours before anyone posted videos on it some dude in my dms showed me look leak from rtl and i was like are you sure about this because i never really trust rtl leaks i mean i do trust them but i i don't the best way to confirm that something is going to be true is by looking at a uh, leak gang leak gang usually don't post rumors and RGL leaks post anything that as soon as they come out so that's the benefit of RGL leaks they post anything that might come true like it's most likely gonna become true but then there's also a chance not everything will be so it's not like the final product you know so yeah Preston said on Twitter that they will not be adding the steampunk hat the top hats because the pets do look really nice with the top hats on but we never know they might add them who knows they got extra time now so could be a thing that they can solve within the next update they got a whole week now in other news Preston also said on discord that he might drop another 50 huge cats now that's not a lot of huge cats but it's still something you know so he has some spare plushies apparently and he all I think he dropped one he's probably gonna drop them randomly uh He's probably gonna say it on Discord, or maybe he's just gonna put it on the website. And so you got, you kind of have to like uh, stalk the website 24/7 to be lucky. I don't know. That news was broken by Alpha GG. I wouldn't have known if he, if I didn't see him post it. But yeah, so it's true. Preston did say that on Discord. Um, here's some screenshots. Now, in my opinion, the huge cats could be, should be, maybe added at a limited time, just the huge cats without the plushies, because a lot of us do not have the huge cats and people that do have the huge cats have an unfair advantage in my opinion like if you bought at least five of them you're gonna be able to grind so much faster than most of us so whenever there's a new update you know players with the huge cats with tons of huge cats will be able to like get all the best stuff very fast now there was only produced about 5,000 plushies which is not that bad that's a lot of plushies and uh, but inside the game huge cats 5000 in existence is not that much so i think it would be really cool if preston added that for a limited time just a huge cat inside the game that you could buy maybe for like one day limited offer maybe for like a update when there's a new update it's like one day offer only you got one day to buy this what do you guys think let me know in the comments coming to present day because what you saw a few seconds ago was recorded yesterday some of it was recorded yesterday. The game footage was recorded yesterday. We now have 2x coin events because there's no update. Preston and Big Games just uh, tweeted about it uh, like an hour ago. So now you got 2x coins event probably until the update hits. So this is your chance to grind tons of this right here. Thus giving you more tech coins. Thus giving you more OP pets. Now that's a pretty good deal. Even though there's no new update, okay? Now, RGL leaks came out with some uh, leaks again. Now, these might actually be 
correct a hundred percent they leaked the new egg the steampunk egg that's going to be released in the next update uh this small update we we don't really know yet to be a hundred percent correct we don't really know yet if this new update is going to be you know a small update or a big update i mean they're gonna add one egg so i guess it's gonna be one small update but they could still add some very nice features that i'm about to talk about soon so as you know in the past i don't like that they don't count the golden eggs as eggs but anywho there's one two three four eggs so they will add a fifth egg and that's the steampunk egg but where's the space for that up here coming soon bro they're thinking about and i didn't even notice until now they're thinking about adding way more eggs in this world than i thought so there will be uh eight eggs here cool who knows they might add more than just one egg but right now there's leaks of that one egg and it's probably gonna be quite more expensive than what we have right here okay now these features here that might come in a future update are not a hundred percent it's not even something coming from the leak gang or rgl leaks or even preston these are ideas guys okay these are ideas coming from you guys from the discord community if you didn't know there's a whole section on discord where you can put in your ideas and people can vote on them so what i did today was look at some very good ideas the ones that get good votes usually get uh, over 20 votes because people are constantly putting in ideas see right here you can see dumb ideas coming from time to time infinite pet equip game pass no he almost did that in the past that's not a good idea three votes 18 down votes there you go pets keep attacking chests even if you get this this one has 27 votes pets keep attacking chests even if you go to another world island now i like that idea i even thought of that myself but never really like thought maybe they should implement it because every time i leave every time i go to another world and my my pets are afk grinding i'm always constantly like why can they not keep grinding while i'm collecting my rewards for example you know so if i leave this world the tech world just to go collect redeem my pets will follow with me which is super annoying when you're afk grinding right so that's a very very good idea my dude another idea i saw that got tons of votes was a uh, boost for you know mythical because people that are free to play players people that play free to play they don't really like you know they don't like spending money or they don't have money so they don't really have a way they don't really have a way to get mythical luck because it's very hard to hatch the mythical pets without the mythical hunter game pass it's, it's actually easier for me with the mythical hunter game pass to hatch legendary pets i mean the other the other way around it's easier for me to hatch mythical pets than it is to hatch like legendaries i only had one legendary in my last grind where I got the tech cat. I got a legendary cat tech cat tech cat tech. I got a legendary cat tech tech cat. Dude, I can't I can't talk. Did I get two? Probably. But they're very hard to hatch. I got more mythicals than I got legendaries. Which is super weird. That's probably something they should fix. But I think it would be a really cool idea to add that Preston for future update sometime soon, maybe. You know? Mythical lock boosts. That would be so nice. So many F2P players will become so happy. You know, Preston, you don't always have to do things for people that are willing to pay. If you do more stuff that are free stuff, the game the game will survive longer, you know? Oh, there we go. I went into a public server and there's the traveling merchant. Now, this is probably the best idea I've seen today. I've seen this quite some times. It's not the first time a lot of people voted for this or a lot of people kept putting in this idea into the idea section in Discord. So I, run across, I, I ran across it many times inside their Discord idea section. So traveling merchant, being able to sell your pets for and the best one i saw the best idea i saw for the 70 percent of the original cost so 70 percent of the price so if you bought it for 206 right you could get 70 percent of that by selling it back that's a brilliant perfect idea not a hundred percent because if you sell it at a hundred percent what's the point you know um so it has to be lower value if you have to sell it so 206 that would be um 160 million or so around 160 million you would get for this one at 70 percent it's a brilliant idea in my opinion because it's quite hard to get gems and sometimes you get a lot of useless pets like i mean at the time they were useful but then eventually they became useless and instead of deleting it would be nice that if you had some op pets not all pets but some of the op pets that you could be able to sell old legendaries old mythicals you know you could also trade them of course but there's not ev not every player goes on discord you know so i think that's a brilliant idea they should add what do you guys think let me know in the comments anywho that's all what i had for today what the heck mm. Mm. 
and subscribe to the channel if you haven't yet already please turn on the notifications please turn on all notifications on your device i really appreciate it to those who take it to the next level become become a true rambler guys turn on the bell guys well that's all what i had for today smash like please <laughs>